So let's, um, you've just, you just said a word there, um, following on from that discussion about leadership, which I also think mm. is quite important, mm. and that is surrounding culture. So briefly, if you will, I'm, I'm interested in, in your understanding and, and what it means to you, that word culture. Yeah, so so obviously it's uh, the context of. I mean, you, you kind of stole my thunder and bringing up the website there, James, because yeah. uh, you know, because because those all speak to uh, how we think about culture. You know, you, well, you, you, I you know, what, what, just because yeah. he's going to be on a separate sort of edit, why don't I just bring up that website again, um, mm -hmm. just so it um, it really does sort of show the values that that you breed. So um, this is what I referenced in a previous question about the culture of leadership. Yes, um, yes, and, and I think we've already talked about the trust and the reputation for excellence. I mean, again, those those are hallmarks of how we think about, um, you know, how we think about um, just how we 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 execute, how we execute, yeah. right? And 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 then you have values, you know, that are also are kind of articulated about, you know, again, the the fundamental ways of how how we do things. So we, you know, we do things with integrity. We do things with purpose. I love the discipline of our platform, and then part of that might be, you know, the discipline of being a public company. But it is part of the the DNA of the company, um, all the way back to its founding in 1970, and how we and how we how we execute, right? The collaborative nature of how we do things um, uh, in the company. And and again, uh, you know, I, I, in my journey, James. You know, I, I am more becoming more of an executive sponsor in the context of the company, and so yeah. that role of um, of bringing in um, bringing in um, uh, perspectives, um, uh, facilitating discussion. So I'll give you an example. So you know, I, t I said I co-chaired our indoor air quality initiative, and you know that was something that uh, Ben Myers, our head of uh, sustainability, and I, you know, talked about on some bike rides during COVID. And we then pull pulled together about twelve thought leaders in the company and went on this journey. Um, you know, around we tried to figure out a, a you know first of all learn about it ourselves as a group. High, you know, deep engineering expertise here in the company, then created a framework for the company and then trade trained 400 people in the company on IAQ, then actually took a business case to the executive team, you know, on, on what we thought we needed to do in terms of our next steps and then executed that, right? So this, that, that, that spot, that, that, that's a role where, um, you know, as I've, I've kind of elevated, uh, not elevated, but really been, it, you know, move to this next phase of my my journey um, and my ability to navigate the company. I'm taking on these kind of roles, right? So yeah, yeah, that makes sense. And it's but the, the important aspect of that sort of cultural there is that it's it's now in in the fabric of the DNA of the company. It's in the fabric of your DNA as you move into that executive executive sponsor sort of role. So it's sort of trickle down, I suppose. Mm.